that time is no more on our side. Apollo, mm -hmm. how far have you gone in collecting the money? I mean the one million we divided among the communities. Uh, well, hello. In the times now, I have my own name. Our king was a good man. Yes. And also a good, a good king. So it was not difficult to collect money from now. If our people are contributing to his bed, I'm happy. Oh. So far, I have raised 750,000. Mm. Yes! Some people promised to pay today. Oh, that is progress. Yes. Yes. Oh. I think uh, our communities are dry. Yes. Yes. Um, <laughs> oh no. Uh, the others of Oma Loma Kingdom. Mm -hmm. As you can see, I am happy. I am smiling. Um, I thank you all for your efforts mm -hmm. to see that my late brother, Igwe Linus Obiozo, is given a big thing very young. But um, you people should know what to yourself because your mother had been selfish. Ah, that is that's it. Please, explain What do you mean by the matter has been selfish? Talk to them. Uh, uh, yeah. So, what my uncle is trying to say is that the uh, chief uh, invited both of us yesterday and we went to his place. <laughs> he now asked us. How far we are prepared for the area. Well, now we told him nothing. There's no money anywhere. He said we should relax. That is going to take care of everything from oh. beginning to end. That is going to bury my father's soul and the yeah. yeah. And um, Chief Omenipe also said that all the king's men in Oma Loma community, he will give them. One car each. And they also say that uh, all the red cap chiefs, as you are now, you will give each of you one good. Oh, yeah. 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 Said he's going to sponsor our equal area in totality. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, what about the money we contributed? That is money that people contributed for the burial. Speak money. What do we do with it? Why are you asking? We will put that one in the community for us. In the Yes. This our Igwe's barrier is one in town. I'm telling you. Yeah. Which barrier have you attended to in this community? See me going home with one crate of malt. Eh? I'm Becky. Going home with one kilo of rice. Hmm. Eh? No one. Hmm. See you going home with one pack of mineral. Hmm. Enjoyment barrier. Ha! Hmm. Hmm. At least this kula of rice. We serve me and my family for the next three days. Your children will be happy. Okay, happy. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Listen, this lady, I don't mind. Oh, I'm enjoying it. Oh, continues. Oh, no.
I was very busy when somebody told me that you sent for me. Sorry, I came this night. But you but no. Okay. Is okay, Zia? Okay, Zia is fine. Uh, he's resting in the house. You know, Mbari, Mbari, this and that. I, that very I am. Ah, Chief Obelito. Thank God for a successful conclusion of the burial of our tradition. I thank God everything went well. Aye. Chief Obelito. That is it. I thank God you were there and saw what happened. People drank and ate, they drank and ate, they drank and ate until they got tired. Some even drank themselves to stupor. Eh? I know you must have spent a, hell of, a lot of money. Oh, well, um, <clears throat> so much. Uh, man, um, <laughs> well, uh, the reason I sent for you is to tell you how much I spent. You know, it's just that and them um, for us to put us together. I don't need anybody to tell me that you spent a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but thank you so much. You really give me a of Well, uh, from the calculation I have, mental calculation, I spent uh, seventeen million nine hundred thousand. Seventeen million nine hundred thousand. That's a big money. Hey, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Hey, it's a big money. Ah, it's a big money. Hey, well, not true, but I, I want us to discuss on the way forward. How you people are going to pay me back? Because it's an investment I made and I'm hoping to recoup my investment. Pay you back? I don't understand. How do you mean you don't understand? When I spend such a whooping sum of money, you think, do you, you take me? What do you take me for? For the Christmas or what? No, 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 no. no. It's something that I'm a businessman. This is an investment. I invested my money and I'm hoping to recoup. From it. It's, it's, you don't need to be saying this. It's, what I expect you to say now is how the, 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 the formula, the way you people pay me back. Business. So, the burial of our late Igwe, Lanyu Sobiozo, is non business. Yeah? Wait, wait, wait. Chief Omen, wait, wait, wait. It's not going to be a good I can remember vividly when you called Prince Okeza and I to your house and told her that we're going to sponsor our little girl's burial. You did not tell us that we will pay you, pay you back the money. So why now? You see, this is the problem I have with you poor people. You think so poor. Eh? You, you, how do you expect me as an idiot or what? To invest such amount of money in the in just ordinary barrier without getting my money back? You shouldn't be saying this. You should what you should say now is how do we pay? Is it this way or the other way around? That's what I expect you to say. Not to pay you back. Not to pay you back. Okay, I don't want it. Coward, now you are talking. What about well um the money I spend is seventeen million nine hundred thousand. You pay it back to me cash, or uh, let me give you a soft landing. You surrender the throne of Omoala my kingdom to me, and I'll still give you thirty million, just for you to go and take care of yourself. Chief <laughs> 
Et tu as la Et moi, je suis là pour la Tu Tu as la Tu Pay you back the 17 million, 900,000 naira you spent on our lazy boys better. Or we surrender the throne to you, the throne of Ogioso family, the throne of Oma Aloma kingdom, inherited by Ogioso family since our four, 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 four fathers. Do, do you know what you said now? Is, what you just said now is abomination. If it is an abomination, abomination, good, fine and good, then be prepared for war. You should prepare for war. Chifo Menif, that Obios of family and Oma Loma kingdom should prepare for war because you sponsored our late Igwe's barrier. Other man, so bad there, no problem. I will go home and tell him it's okay so that both of us will come back to your house and you say this thing you just vomited now in his presence. We should surrender the throne of Omar Loma to you. Oh, yes. The throne negated by Odioso family from our four, 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 four fathers. Chief Romanifer, I don't know, and the entire elders sent for you. We had wanted to come to your house to thank you for our Igwe's burial. Which you single handedly sponsor it. But before then, we heard that you asked Prince Okeze here to pay you back the money you donated to the community. Or that he will hand over the throne to you as a payback. So the free will donation you made to the entire community. More okay, dear. I could not believe it. So also the elders. That is the reason why we call you. <clears throat> to come and tell us your own part of the story. Oh, wait, you are very, very correct. I'm, I'm not a father Christmas, yeah? <laughs> Do I look like one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Every death is actually paid, eh? What you have is correct, absolutely correct. Is that the wrong with what I just said? Meaning that what we had is true. <laughs> Meaning that. Listen. If okay, see here. Okay, no comment. No comment. No comment. No comment. No talk about it. Sorry, my dear. If you ask me about the throne of Alama Kingdom, I love you. Fine. You'll be happy. You'll smile. Because what I'm going to do to this kingdom. It's better imagine. I will turn every way around. Yes, I'm going to build roads. Tight. <laughs> I'm going to build recreational centers. I'll build schools, you know. I will attract police presence. I will have police station. Yeah. I'm going to build prison. Prison! <laughs> yes, For correction now, you know. Hey. Excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> Hello? Uh, Tali. Oh, Tali, my boy. Uh, okay, I'll get back to you because I'm in a, I'm in a meeting. Thank you. So, what am I saying? That I am going to improve the lot of this kingdom. <laughs> Just allow me. Give me time to express myself. Honestly, give me time. My elders. You've had the chief for many. Mm -hmm. yes. Do you have anything to say or ask him? Yes. Uh, chief of I want to thank you specially for single handedly sponsoring the barrier of our late Igwe. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> but I have a question for you. I remember very well that. You are still the richest man for the past 10 years in this kingdom. Oh, yes, I am still the richest. Please, can you tell us one person 
that you have had in this kingdom to become somebody. Bam. Don't Or, uh, uh, let me not bother you much. Can you show us one or two things you have done for this kingdom for that past 10 years? Oh. Okay, let me not go far. Let's come back to your family. I know that your uncle's children are the nuisance who have in this kingdom. Uh -huh. Have you been able to help one of them to become somebody? Oh. Zaya, Tell us. You... Very good question. Answer him. Zaya. Answer him. My fellow elders, I saw this coming. And I want Prince Okeze here. But he would not listen. Just look at where the whole thing has landed us. But Ola, let me be buying her now. She for many things. Listen and listen carefully. Nobody is paying you back anything. The throne is not your own. It belongs to Prince Okezia and family. And that is all. You people just had his call. That means he is important or that he's going to use to flog all of us everybody. here. <laughs> Is there more? You are welcome. You are welcome. Is there more? I for land. I greet you all. Is there more? Concerning the kingship of this land, it is hereditary. Mm -hmm. wow. No one dreams of shifting it, tampering with it. As it will mean interrupting the natural process of the gods. Uh. Anyone that tries will live to regret the day he was born. Born well. Chief Omenife, be warned. Chief Omenife, be warned. Chief Omenife. Did you hear that? That you can never be the Igwe of Omo Aloma Kingdom. Why? Huh? The chief priest can never hand over the offer of Omo Aloma to you. Or Paro Kokomi. It's in Chile. Nonsense. Arant nonsense. I smell conspiracy. We shall see. What, what is wrong with this man? Uh, okay. Uh, 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 nonsense. Uh, nonsense. Uh, uh, nonsense. Uh, what is wrong with this man? Uh, uh, this man? Uh, uh, fellow elders, <laughs> if you ask me, I will say. Uh, let me reserve my. In Alugwego, in Alugwego, in Say what you want to say. He now comment to reserve, okay? Now reserve comment. Look at you, Nyenka. Eh? Nothing, nothing. You did go to Azo. I said nothing. Eh, because. It's a good Eh? Hmm. Anya Mara Krosinwa. Anya Mara Krosinwa. Anya Mara Krosinwa. We found ourselves in this dungeon just because of money. Here go. If I go. My husband, what is it? Why are you playing outside and doing stand up your head? You're sitting around. Is everything okay? That is true. That is serious trouble. True. True. Is it about the chief of the place to pay him for giving the trouble? 
this. Asked him to forget about it. They did, but he insists. Even the chief priest told him that what he's asking for is impossible. That if he continues, he will live to regret it. My husband, that shouldn't bother you. Since the chief priest and the elders of this kingdom have talked to him about it, I believe he will, he will not go on with the demand again. I don't think so. Because that's words before leaving the meeting today. It was a praise and Um, by the way, where is my son of Mecca Naya? He's inside. Please get him for me. Why? Is there any problem? Ah, no problem at all. I just want to talk myself. Because of money, yeah, God. If I go, my man, I will say, in this dungeon, because of money. If I go Melanie I must rule this kingdom by force My God was a little more I My God I've been a guy I'm contacting Connection more Butu butu Yafu yafu Mekanda ya my son How are you? Omekandaya, you will grow to be a great man. And I, your father, will never forget you forever. Oh, Edo. It's taking me. It's cool now. Oh. I got the butcher. I got the butcher. The way to be. Huh? Meanwhile, I have sent out the youth to go in search of him. And I know they will find him. You know, children of nowadays, he might have gone out to play yeah. with other children. So please calm down. Which friend? A boy of two years. What does he know? And where does he know he can go to? Barely eight, eight days I lost my husband, now my son. Listen, uh, princess. You see, like the GSS, he might have gone out to play with other children. Yeah. Mm. Uh, nothing will happen to him. That I'm sure of. Mm. Eh? Relax. Please, Don't relax yourself. Eh? Eh? You know uh, you are double. Please. Calm down. Please. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Who is doing this in this family? Go to our land. 
Let me okay. see that something has happened to uh, this boy, Omeka uh, yeah? our, 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 our future is going to be. Go Let me not be that something has happened to him. Go for me, not you have to my son. Hey! 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 Wait, 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 calm down, boy, wait, calm down. How did you go? Midas, we we'll search everywhere in the bush. And we saw this knife and this singlet. Stained with blood. And in the spot where we saw it, there a lot of blood there. So we decided to bring it back. This is my son's son. Ready to get this and raise my son! Oh, my is dead, you. Huh? 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 We are here to discuss the way forward of our great kingdom by planning on who to take over the throne of Omar Lama Kingdom. Knowing that our king, Linus Mukiosi, is dead, and his son, Prince Okezie, who is supposed to mount the throne after him. Is dead. Prince Okizia's son, Prince Omega Man, is also dead. So let us look into the family according to custom and tradition of our people. Ochoba here is the next person in line to take over the throne as he were of Omo and Oma Kenya. I don't know if anybody has anything to say. <laughs> There's no need. <laughs> okay, if there's any. Yes or no, I have something to say. Uh, 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 can you hold on, please? Yeah? Take it easy. Yeah? You see, there is no need to be love or disclutter or elephantiasis. Obaguri, it will be in book. Hmm? Makano to talk with Adrono Kambede. What Ono Uye has said does not require too much debate. Bagul. Yes, what we should be discussing now is how to make Ochoba here the next Igbe of Umaloma. Eh? What are we talking about now? Uh, 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 that's of Umaloma Kingdom. I did it all. And I also thank you all for your efforts to see that I will be crowned Igbe of Umaloma Kingdom. Oh, yeah, my mom, oh, my It's a good thing. Because, uh, on that easy, it's a matter of number one. Yeah, we're going to go. Oh, my God. Mama, come back there, you could You see that too? I'm not going to say. Hey, you see that too? Hey, you see that too? Hey, you see that too? Hey, you see that I am not interested. I'm not interested. I'm not interested. Why? Tell us the origin. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Is what is the meaning of what you just said? Oh no, please, I'm happy. Oh no, go by the end. Oh no, the meaning is that we are in a new generation. This issue of it will be related to this family or the other family because of one tradition or the other is no longer in existence. Eh? It will now go to rich people so that they can take care of their communities. Okay, now. We all witnessed what happened during the time my late brother, Igwelainus Obioso, died. We went to the places we are not supposed to. We entered the places we are not supposed to enter. 
because we could not afford 8 million naira. 8 million naira for his failure. If not, if for many things, oh, she could have come in with it. Okay, I'm okay, it's more mad. If not, if for many things, who sponsored my late brother's failure? What would have happened? Eh? What would have happened? In fact, to tell you the truth, uh, I've given the truth to uh, uh, Chico Menizer. So you people should start planning on how to cram the work of uh, uh, Omar Lama Kingdom. Give me a little bit of 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 to be frank with you, I saw this coming. But it is not clear to me that my suspicions are real. But don't worry. When the time comes, Otuba here will see what he has done to himself. <laughs> is it the cause of what? <laughs> no and please, I beg of you all. Nobody should fight Chief Omenife on this again. <laughs> but let us tell him the truth. Hey, hey, get back here. Never allow one on the other. Get back here. Get back here. Watch over. Again. Watch over. Again. How many times have I called you? Okay, I'm sorry. Hey, come. Do you realize the gravity of what you have just done? Do you realize the, 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 the weight of what you have done? Uh, um, uh, uh, oh no, this is the truth. What truth? The truth is that the is the one capable of taking the, the, the throne. Hey. And the I'm going to go to the house. No, wait. <laughs> I have not finished introducing the lad for you. <laughs> no, let's farm. Mama, let's farm. Let's farm. That's the yeah, most important I thing. I knew you were here. I knew it. Yeah. Mama. What are you doing, Mama, lad, with your daughter? Ochoba. You are asking me what I'm doing on my late husband's land. Eh? I don't know. If you don't know, my daughter and I have come to clear this land. Yes. So that we can farm on it. Exactly. I don't understand you, Uncle. What do you want from us? Can you hit you from uh -huh. us? Eh? This is my late father's farmland. And we have every right to work on it. On it? Look at this one. Says who? Oh, yes, you go. Eh? No, let me ask you. This is your late father you are talking about. Do you know him? Is he fair or dark? You see? You don't know. You don't know. Now you listen to me. This land belongs to me. I don't want to see any of you on this land again. Says who? Ochoba says who? I am so disappointed. I'm so disappointed at you. An old man like you. Look at the question you just asked me. If my late father was fair or dark. Well, it is not my fault that I didn't meet him. And I will not I will not question God. But I want you to know this. My mother here has told me everything. Yes. She told me all that I need to know, the history about how you and my late father shared all your properties equally. Well, and that this land here belongs to my late father. Yes. I have been respecting you, Uncle. I have given you all my respect. But please, if you know you do not want me to start disrespecting you from this moment, stay away from us. Leave us alone, else I will have it hurt you. Yes. What is your problem, Uncle? Let us be. Oh, your mother has told you everything. Yes. How this land was shared equally. Yes. Now tell me, in which community does a woman own lands? I don't want to know. 
I don't know. You don't want to know. What I know is that since this lamp belongs to my late father and he's no more alive, that means whatever that belongs to him now belongs to us. Both of you leave this land now. What not if you know? We are not going anywhere. This is my late husband's land. Iwama. And then we must farm on this we land. We must farm on it. Iwama. So should we starve? Uzi. Leave so this land. Leave this land. Leave this land, both of you. You have taken all the lands and properties <laughs> that my, my late husband left for us. I don't want to leave. You don't want to leave. Okay. You are going nowhere. Yes. Water. Whatever you want. So we should starve, okay? So we starve because of you. So let's go. Let's go. Let this my daughter, <sighs> you needed to have seen what your father did to us. What is all this? Yeah. If not that we ran away, your father would have pushed. <laughs> Where are they? What are they? What are you? You are here. Now listen to me. If I see you in that land the next time, if I see both of you in that land, that, that, that next time, you will see what I will do to you. Oh, what did we do to you? What did we do to you? Why are you treating us this way? What? You took everything away from us. Now you still are treating us. What did we do to you? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Your father is dead. Your husband is dead. Both of you are no longer needed in the Joseph family. I love it on the Joseph properties. What is it? Papa! Uh, papa, what is the meaning of this? What is the meaning of this, Papa? I'm asking! Uh, uh, what nonsense are you asking me? Why won't I ask you? Stop pretending not to know why I'm asking you that. Why would you go on your farmland and chase them out as if you own the whole place? Is that your farm, Papa? Do you own the farm? Don't you have your own portion of the farm? Oh. Papa, what is this? Why are you being wicked and heartless? Are you not tired of being heartless, Papa? Are you not tired? Is it me you are talking to me? Yes, it's you, Papa. You are talking to me, your father. Yes, I am talking to you. Go back. Papa, I am not afraid Lita, of you. Papa, go back. You are not afraid of me. Go back. Papa, enough of this rubbish. Your wickedness has to stop. Lita, are you not tired of being wicked? What do you even gain? What do you gain, Papa? Why? You are... Why are you doing this? I do not blame you. I only blame them for letting you make you into their life all the time. I save you all the whole world. When next he tries this on your farmland, Get a big stick and break his coconut head. Hey, what? what did you say? You heard me. You are asking, you, asking you to break your father's head. Break your head, Papa. My daughter asked you to break my head. Oh, yeah, break. She will break it. Let's step on that land. Papa, do not step on that land. Papa, you can't do that. Rita, please, come on. Come on, come on. Rita, please, come on. Come on, 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 come on. Hey, so, I try to leave for Zukita. I'm going to have to leave for Zukita. Papa, don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. We can't man. We are afraid of you. Please, call your sister back. Enough is enough. Wicked man. You're such a wicked man. So wicked. Wicked man. That's who you are. That's rubbish. Please, please. Thank you. Why is he doing this? It's okay. Why? Is it enough? Please. Please, stop. Hi. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for all of this. I'm sorry about my father. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm sorry. Thank you. 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 I hope there's no problem. Mm, there won't be any problem. That is if you cooperate. If I cooperate, how? Ah, why are you sounding like this? Yesterday was our environmental. You did not show up. Yes. Tony, I'm sorry now. You, you know the nature of my job. Mm -hmm. You know I always come back late. Don't be sorry, Matave. Tell him uh, well, we're not that now, boss. Did you take any permission from anybody? I know that's my crime. I didn't take permission from anyone. Oh, don't get problem Thank either. you very much. You said that is your crime. So for the fact that there is a crime, there is a levy to be paid. Eh? Give us our money now. Let's go and collect money from other people. We are running out of time. So, how much is it? 3,000. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
in chapter up now we go under place to collect money now. It's supposed to be two thousand. Why are you asking for three thousand? Uh, well, what huh? are we talking about? We bring three, bring three. Oh, my God, my God. Oh, you're as free as bed, yeah? Yeah, I'm going to get up again. You're as free as bed now. Calm down. Nice, let me tell you. Okay, calm down. Woman, your hard work you he doesn't want to put the time to understand everyone. Eh? Uh -huh. Don't meddle with his properties, right? Igwe. Igwe, I have heard all you said. The land in question belongs to my husband. The pine trees also belongs to my late husband. Ochoba here has his own. They shared everything equal. Why would Ochoba say I should not enter into my late husband's properties? Why? I don't know what I've done to him. Now listen to me, Mama. We are not here to do question and answer or to rub shoulder. Eh? Now listen to me, you see those properties? You will not touch any of them until you pay me back all the money I spent on your late husband's burial. Do you hear me? Your Majesty, one hand. One hand. I'm coming here, Jekuya. I think we're too much. Yes, sir. He spent so much money on his husband's okay. So it's, it's normal, it's normal that you pray. And so, based on that, don't enter into his house. Don't make any use of his properties, right? Uh -huh. uh, just so bad. Thank you, Your Majesty. We live long. Thank God you were there. You, 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 uh, you saw uh, uh, how I was spending money, lavishing money, everything. If everybody, all of them, we are eating and enjoying. I spent so much money that so she must pay me all the money I spent. If I ever see you on that land, you're going to make it for you. Come for your hands. 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 You can take all the property, the mango tree, the lands, the palm trees, all that your late brother left for us. You can take them. But all I believe in this life is that one day, one day, God will vindicate me. <laughs> the Lord will surely vindicate me. Now you are talking. When I never, never, never answered question and answer. Now you are talking. The girl had me. Now she said the truth because she knows that I am the owner of those things. She said, "Woman, uh, this place is not a good sanctuary. Yes, I don't preach. The Lord to your house just do as I said. Make sure you don't disobey my orders, right?" And listen, even those cassavas on that land, even the Fuku, Europe, Kenya, because they now belong to me. Oh, my God. Can I hear you? You did just to hear you. I said you can go. We are done with this case. And that I should not touch even the I case. said go. All I put in my land, I should not take anyone. Oh, boy. Please show her to me. No, no, no. Don't worry. Your Majesty, please. Allow me. Before she goes out there and tell people that uh, uh, I could not with the gas to throw her out of the palace. I'm 
Auntie Homer. So you mean to say that my father and the Igwe ask you to return the money my father spent on your late husband's burial before you can actually claim those properties? Yes. And Igwe supported him. <laughs> Hi. Oh my God. So, why did your father do this to us? Why? Does my poor mother do it to him? <laughs> no, that he has taken everything. How does he expect us to feed? Where does he expect us to get what to eat? No land, no palm tree, no even oranges or mangoes, nothing. He took everything that belonged to my late father. Why is he doing this to us? Why? Why is he doing this? <laughs> the Igwe can reach this kind of jungle justice. Then I really wonder the kind of Igwe he is. <sighs> but not to worry. Something has to be done about this. Yes. What? Excuse me. Where are you going to? Rita! They got a money jump she was fun, a weapon to her. I buy your piano, you put us to one, put in your job. You want your room, one, put on your job. You run that, you come where you are. What are you doing? Call me when I attend to you. What do you like with another patient inside? I, I wait for the yes, I wait for But he's busy with another patient inside. I wait for him. I like the way he attends to me. You know that the drug he gave me the other time. Ah, it worked very properly in my body and I recovered very fast. <laughs> so you take this, huh? Three times a day. Morning, afternoon, and night. Okay? Okay. This one. You take this twice a day, morning and night, and make sure you take a lot of water. It's very important, huh? And eat before you take them. Do you understand? In three days, I'm sure you'll be fine. Are you telling me that if we're gonna leave this shop, you will not come to this shop again? Oh God, so we don't have to see it that way. Uh, but wait, wait until then. Eh? Let's wait until then. <sighs> How you am your customer? Okay. Okay, Uncle Bina. So sorry. I will do as you've instructed. <laughs> Should be on my way. All right. Thank you. Sorry, yeah. Careful. Huh? Thank you. 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 temperature but I'll get you some drugs now okay, okay. you'll be fine huh? twice daily one in the morning and one at night okay ensure you eat before you take take the drugs 
All right? Please. Thank you very much. Please, how much is this? Um, it's just 600. Please take a lot of water too. All right? Okay. Hey, don't Please trust me, I'm seeing this. Just hold this and I'll give you 500 and give you one pass. Even if I did not come by myself, I will give somebody to give you, please. Don't worry, just go and yeah. take, take the drugs, alright? Take a lot of water too. Okay. I'm sure you'll be done in three days. Thank you. Alright? Yeah. Take care. Next time, man. I'll be in a Abina, sir, do you know when you stop working here, I will have a problem? Because all the customers depends on you. Sir, I don't think so. The truth is, you are never around. I am always here. I feel like the customers are used to me. If you were here, it would have been the same thing. Please, I, I don't I don't think they depend on me. It's just because they are used to me. Abina. Sir. I must confess. Do you know that since you started working here, the business is good. Please, can we have a joint business? So that when you leave, I will not lose my customers. Sir, you will not lose your customers, I promise you. Eh? You, won't, you won't lose. Why will you lose your customers? You won't. I didn't have an affair. I may lose my customers more. I will lose my customers. Because all of them will be in my hair, will be in my hair. Just accept. Sir, you will not lose your customers. I promise you, you won't lose your customers. Okay, you can go. I See, eh? I just came here to warn you. I came here to warn you to leave and take your man to a room. Papa, avoid them, oh. Eh? Is it too much to ask? Leave those people alone. Avoid their properties and lands. Leave them alone. Hey! Hmm. Janita, are you mad? Yeah. Eh? So you have grown so much that you can stand before the Igwe and begin to run your mouth. Are you no longer afraid? Is your baby? Young girl, listen. You are so lucky. I allowed you because I'm in a good mood. And besides, your father is a very good friend of mine. Else, he uh, would have... See the best of me. Okay now. Not a problem. Papa, continue to drink your wine. Drink as much as you want to drink. I have passed my message. The message is that you should leave them alone. Papa, leave them alone in peace. Would you respect Mr. Igwe? You're not coming to talk. I only came here to talk to my father. Besides, we all know how you became the Igwe, sir. Hey! Well, that's a story for another day. Mpa! Leave them alone. Avoid them. Leave them alone. That is the message. Oh? Look at this girl. Father. Who was that girl and why was she talking to you like that? Uh, never mind. You mean a commoner would walk into this palace, talk to you anyhow and walk away just like that? Mm -hmm. Don't worry, I loved her because of her father was my friend and connive with your friend or Choba to take away what belongs to that widow. Omenife, have you seen one of the reasons I never supported you when you were planning to be the way of our great kingdom, Omo Aloma? I know you too well. Please, tell your friend or Choba to remove his hands from whatever that belongs to that widow because her late husband left those things for her. I'm trying to assimilate. The garbage of Shoba's daughter came here to drop for me. I forgive her because she is my friend's daughter. And here you are, talking another nonsense. Now, let me tell you, 
I'm not in the mood. If you try such rubbish again, I will show you the other side of me. It's okay. I will leave. But before I leave, I have to remind you of what I said. Tell your friend, Ochoba, to remove his hands from Ihuama's properties. Failing to do that, both of you that pass this jungle justice will leave to face it. Take this food up. Don't touch me. I'm already on my way. Don't lay those your filthy hands on me. Now that you are finished learning the job business, and you want to set up your own chemist, I don't want you to set it up in this community. Papa, why? You see. I don't want you to compete with your master at all. Your master depended so much on you when you were with him. And so were the customers. They loved the way you deliver and, you know, the way you treated them. So once they discover that you have your own shop in the same community, most of them are going to shift. They will move to you. And your master's business will have problems. You, you know what? That means. Papa, you have a point. But where do you suggest I, I get a shop? Uh, Umaloma. Yes. Umaloma community. I know you can make it because you are good in the business. Once you go there, quickly you will get customers. Yeah, you will raise your own. But Papa, Umaloma is far now. It's far. And you know I close work very late at night. Uh, I know, but don't worry. Don't worry. I will release my bicycle to you to be using. Then, as soon as you make more money, you buy your own motorcycle. I would have asked your younger brother who is in the city to help out, but uh, his business is not yet strong enough. Papa, there's no point. I should be the one sending money to my brother, not the other way around. Okay. okay. It's okay. You just do me a favor and get the shop quickly. Hmm? Once you do that, let me know so that I can give you the little money I can help you with. Yes. Thank you, Papa. It's okay, my son. Thank you. Hey. Ngechi. Yes, Papa. What are you doing? Call me. I'm sweeping the house. Okay. Kindly fetch some water for me. I need to have my bath. Alright, alright. Papa, once I find a place, I'll let you know. Hold it. Let me quickly have my bath. What's the matter? Your Majesty, I am worried. Over what? You have to be very careful the way you handle some cases brought here into this place. Especially anything that has to do with Ochoba. You are always supporting him, even when he is wrong. People are watching. It's not right. Your Majesty, please, don't forget that a lot of people here in this kingdom are not happy that you became the Igwe. I don't want people to go against you. You need to mellow down. Tread with caution. Please. Is that all? Now listen. This is Omar Roma Kingdom. I'm in charge. Yes, I'm the king here. Nobody dictates to me how to run my kingdom. It is my exclusive right. Nobody dictates to me. As for Choba, you know, he is the reason I am here. He gave me this job. I am sitting up. Oh, yes. So, however I treat him, it's nobody's business. It is my right. So, I don't want anybody to go there. Please. 
your majesty. Please, I am begging. You need to find a way to reduce the level of authority on people. They are your subjects. Is that a suggestion or a threat? I just made a suggestion. I will not lie to you. You are my husband before you became the Igwe of this kingdom. If I don't tell you the truth, who will I tell? Thank you. I have heard your truth and your truth is not pleasing to me. Allow me to do what my conscience tells me. And as a matter of fact, this discussion is over. You can now go. So I, I said you can now leave. Apologies, my friend. My orders are final. If I'm cool, good, no game. I'm a digital king. Una no go. I was looking for you and one of the mates told me that you are here. What is the matter? But I want to ask you a question. Okay, um, listening. How did father become the Igwe of this community? Because from the history of this community, our family is not a royal family. The Igwe ship is not in any way in our lineage. So, how come? Is that all you want to ask? Yes, mother. I need an answer. Well, like you rightly said, we don't belong to the blue blood. Well, your father bought the throne from his best friend. It was his turn to become the king, but he begged your father. So your father bought the throne from him. He said he's poor. He cannot maintain the kingdom if being crowned king. That is how we became the royal family. And that is how your father became the Igwe of this kingdom. No wonder that girl spoke to father like that. I mean, Ochuba's daughter. Mm -mm. Not actually because of that. You see, that girl spoke to your father in that manner because of the unfair judgment your father passed on a woman's property, knowing full well that the property is not Ochuba's own. So the girl got angry. Mother, but he is your husband. Why not talk some sense into him? Why not talk to him? My dear. You see, I have spoken to your father. But he told me there's nothing he can do. All he needs to do is to make Ochoba happy so that the throne still belongs to him. Mother, this is so wrong. Now you understand where I am coming from. Now you understand why that girl was angry. This is not right. I know. But we cannot do anything about it. It is the Igwe. Are you happy? Let's go inside. Come on. It's all right. We can still We bought it. Madam, I'm very happy to see you. Two days ago, you were very sick, but now you look stronger. 
Ah, my son, all things rely on you. Do you know that I've been suffering for this sickness for so long? And I've been buying drugs for different chemists. And none of the drugs work for me. Mm. Until someone directed me to your shop. And those drugs you gave me work very well. Mm. God will bless you, my son. Thank you. Amen. Madam, the truth is, um, you see, malaria is a very serious sickness. Mm -hmm. hmm? It is unfortunate that here in Africa we take it for granted because yeah. uh, people feel like uh, they have all kinds of drugs to treat it. But in other developed countries, if you have malaria, they will isolate you. Mm -hmm. They will quarantine you. Do you know what the meaning of no, quarantine is? No. They will treat you like you have HIV. Come oh, for beats. <laughs> it's not our portion though. <laughs> Hmm. That, that is why it's very important that you mm -hmm. protect yourself. Hmm? Yeah. You clean your environment, you fumigate your environment, you ensure that you don't have mosquitoes in your house. Ah. Very important. I will do as he said. Okay. Oh, you asked me to come today. Yes, you have one more injection to take. So I'll get you more drugs and uh, I'll give you some multivitamin as well. So when you're done with your malaria treatment, you can, you can have them. Ah. Okay. What about the money? You know I've not finished paying you for the one you already gave me. Um, Madam, let us treat you first. <sighs> when you get better, we can talk about money. Huh? <sighs> come oh, in. thank you very come much. In, come and sit down. Come in. You will never lack my son. Thank you. God will bless you. you. Said you wanted to talk to us. <sighs> Papa, I would like to ask you a question. Please, what has Auntie Homa and Uju done to you that you have decided not to let them have peace in this compound? What have they done? Because I've been asking myself the same question. I have searched and searched. I can't find any reason you're doing all of these things to them. Papa was there the other day. You were telling her that she owes you money from her late husband's burial and that she needs to pay you back. You said failure for her to return the money. You're going to seize all the properties her late husband, my uncle, your own brother, left for her. Papa Pico, what is it? But what kind of evil is this? What is it? Eh? This was exactly the same thing my late mother went through in your hands before she died. Are you in any way accusing me of killing my wife, your mother? Hey, I didn't say anything like that. Papa, I am not accusing you of anything. Eh? I'm not accusing you of anything. Papa, you know the truth. Deep down in you, you know the truth. Papa, let me remind you. In case you have forgotten. But I'm very sure that you have not forgotten. You can only pretend to have forgotten, Papa. This same woman you accuse of owing you money. It's the same woman you sold her husband's birthright for 30 million naira to that useless way. Papa, did you give her the money? No, no, no. Papa, how much did you give her from the money? I mean the sale of the Igwe ship. How much? Papa, you gave her nothing. Let me tell you. You are the one owing that woman. Papa, you owe her and you have to pay. Biko, leave her alone. Leave her and her child alone to live in peace. <laughs> with all the money you made from the sales, where is the money today? What did you even do with it? Nothing. Look at Polika. I mean, look at the house we live in. We are still as wretched and poor as ever. With nothing to show for it. This house was built by the late Igwe. Back to the same Polika, your son. One you sent to the city with plenty of money. He is back here in this village. Few months after he has squandered all the money he left for the city with. With nothing to show for it. Roaming around the streets, smoking in their head. Ah! What is it? Hey my friend, what kind of rubbish is that one now? Who is this? Don't bring me into this matter. Eh? Why are you insulting me? I said shut up, hey, hey, keep quiet, Joe. Keep quiet. I said shut up. What? what kind of rubbish is that? Why you yourself? Huh? Let me even ask you. Who told you that Papa here was mm -hmm. the one who sold the throne to, uh, to, to Igwe Omenife? Eh? For your information. Mm -hmm. 
the Igwe of this family died. Oh. He had no history. Oh. See how senseless and stupid you sound. You're the one that's stupid. Very dull, dull and stupid. Look at you, empty head. What do you even know? Do you know the family history? Do you know? Professor, teach me now. Your father sold the Igwe ship for 30 million naira. You cannot tell me otherwise. It's, it's obvious your mouth is itching you to talk. Were you not here when he was telling us his story about how he was duped millions of naira many years ago? Before uncle, uh, uh, can man die, can man bury him? Why were they duping? How did he make the money in the first place? <laughs> Rubbish. Rita. Mpa. So Rita, you brought me out here this night to insult me, your father. You brought me out here this night, Rita, to insult me or talk back, your father. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm very, 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 very no sorry. Problem. I'm sorry for insulting you. I'm sorry if I have insulted you. Please, I'm sorry, Papa. I'm so sorry. But with due respect, with due respect, Papa, leave Auntie Yoma and Dre alone. Leave them alone in this room. Let them have peace and quiet in this compound. Papa, desist from anything that has to do with them. Papa, avoid the properties that belong to them. Avoid their farmland. Avoid their properties. Their mangoes. Everything that belongs to them. Papa, avoid it though. Hey, with due respect, though, with due respect. Well, you had your sister insulting me, her father. Rita is insulting me, Ochoba, her father. Mm. Now, you listen to me, Rita. Listen, 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 listen to me, and listen to me. If you try this nonsense next time, any other day you insult me in this house, mm, Makachu, I will kill you. I can argue, maybe they will you, will see one million. And I'm part of it. Try this nonsense next time and see what I will do to you. If I've said my own. Parrot. I've said my own. Parrot. You You just open your mouth to talk in me now. Mm. You said you open your mouth now to insult our father. No respect. And so what? No respect for ever. I think you can't keep you. You this rubbish in this house. I'll give you a dirty slap. Hey! Hit it! I'll slap you. I said hit me. Slap me! I'll hit me now. I'll hit me now. What is all this? All of this doctor's number is going through. I don't need to try another of his number, please. I have tried all his numbers and it's not going. No, no, no. Try, try another hospital, please. My daughter is dying. My queen. There's this boy that I had open a new chemist shop in the village and he's really doing well. Take one of the guys. Go to the boy. Tell him I want to see him here. Okay. And let him come with as many drugs as possible. Okay. Please go. Okay. Okay. What is keeping the maid and the guard? They are taking too long. My daughter is dying. I wonder what is keeping them. Does it mean the boy is not in this chemist shop? God forbid. They must come here with the boy. My daughter needs to be treated. You, you, Your Majesty, please. Can you send more guards after them? Eh? They are taking too long. Please. Kept you. Where is the boy? He didn't come with us, but he gave us these drugs to give to the princess, and he assured us that if you take the drugs, she'll be okay. You mean what? Why didn't he come with you, people? Your Majesty, he said that it's too late, and when he's leaving, it's too far. Get, 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 Okay, this is that I to... Okay, and this too. Alright, Your Majesty. 
let's give her the medication as instructed by the boy. Please. And you, get a drinking water. Be quick! Oh, sorry. You'll be fine, princess. You'll be fine. Tomorrow. I if I God, thank God, thank God. Man, you mean you slept here? Yes. I did. I couldn't get myself to leave you here all alone. I was so afraid. But, but, what happened? Why did I sleep off like that? My dear. You almost died yesterday night. All our efforts to get a daughter to attend to you was fruitless. But thank God we got a chemist boy who gave us some drugs and there. Assured us that you'll be fine after taking them by tomorrow morning. My daughter, you are big. Yes. Father. So you looking good and thank God. You almost put us into fear yesterday when you passed out. Honestly. But thanks to that chemist boy's truck that revived you. But who is this chemist boy? Uh, well, never mind. Um, we'll talk about that. Now, darling. Your Majesty. Please instruct the medians to cook her food. So that she will eat it and then take her drives. All right. Oh. You need to eat <laughs> so that you take your drive. But I'm fine now. Oh, thank you. Just take it. Just take it. I'm coming. Take your drugs and relax. I got a good job. Uh, son. Papa. You are awake? Yes, my son. Good morning. I hope you slept well. Yes, I did. Morning. I hope you are good too. Yes, yes. Uh, I was trying to wash my face. Okay. But please, come. Get a chair. I want us to sit down and talk about something. No, no, Papa. It's okay. I can you sure you will stand? Yes, I can. It's okay. Son? Papa? I don't like the way you come back late at night due to your business, the nature of your business. I don't think it's safe. See, I would rather you rented a house in that community so that whenever you close late, you just go there and have a good rest. It's not nice. Coming like this and then if you had money, you just buy, what do you call it? A motorbike. Buy a machine. So that you can increase this, the, the, the pace of your, you know, your return. Please. I, I don't think I'm comfortable with you coming this late. Your, 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 your,
Asia is quite but I'd rather go to the shop for now. Um, however, I'll uh, try to get to the side to ease my movement. Uh, yes. Better still, I can still pass the night in my shop once I realize it is late to come back home. Are you sure your shop is safe? Oh, yes, Papa. It's very. That she's very angry with her father because of the way he's been treating us. She's so angry that he took everything from us, the land, everything. And she says she's going to have it hot with him until he releases everything back to us. And I, I know, I, 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 I feel that's what she's going to do. Because last night, I overheard them having issues over this same matter. You mean it? Yes, Mama. Overheard it. You mean she said all this? Yes, so. Rita yes. and daughter. Hey! Yes. I know. Rita is a good girl. Yes. Just like her late mother. Her late mother was a good woman. Before death took her away from us. Oh. May her so rest in peace. Amen. <sighs> Amen. <sighs> Mama, that's not even all. Though. She said we should get prepared. Mm. That tomorrow we're going to that farm to see what we can get from there. Huh? No, my daughter, no, I don't want to show us problem. Hey, my no, we're going to go. I don't agree with you. We will go there tomorrow. My daughter says she's going to follow us to the farm. Oh. Yes, so with her there, I'm very sure Uncle Ochuba will not do anything. Rita said that. Yes, she says she's following us. Okay, if you say so, no problem. Oh, yeah, clear all this so that you go and dress bed. Let's go to bed early so that we can wake up early and go to the farm. <laughs> She was born, a way put a boy, a boy on piano joe. I put a show, one put the roger. One piano, one put on your job. Where is that? Where is it? 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 Papa, what is it? Why are you screaming my name? What did you tell the woman, her daughter? What did I tell the woman, her daughter? Papa, I don't understand. What do you mean? My friend, are you mad? Is something wrong with you upstairs? Answer Papa's question now, eh? Have you forgotten what you told them? In Akwala. Are you, are you crazy? Something wrong with you. Let me ask the question I'm asking. Are you, are you, are you okay? Why would you talk to me now? Wait, wait. Let's, it's okay. I am here. Don't worry. Yeah, Rita. Rita. Papa. Let me remind you in case you have forgotten. Why did he tell you and her mother that you'll be going to that our land at Rosal to farm on that land? Why? Oh. Oh, Mpa. That's all. Ha -ha. Here. I honestly was thinking that something else is wrong, go. Oh. Papa, so this is it. Why I told them that? Papa, it's very simple. The reason I told them is because they are the real owners of the land. The original and the rightful owners of the land. That's why I told them. What is it? Papa, please. Papa, please, I beg you in God's name. I don't want to shout this night. I don't want our neighbors to hear my voice this night. Please, oh. Please. Papa, don't make me remember how my mother died mysteriously in this house, oh. Papa, because if I flash back, Papa, if I flash back, you're going to have your heart with me, oh! Papa, don't make me flash back, oh! It hey! Is that you're mad. Do you hear me? Rita, it is obvious that you're mad. <laughs> now listen to me. If you don't take time in this house, I will deal with you. Papa, see, let me tell you. Let me tell you. Listen and listen carefully. I, Rita, I am going to that land with them tomorrow and nothing can happen. Papa, 
regardless of whatever jungle justice you and that stupid Igwe must have wished on this matter. Papa, I am going with them. If you like, bring heaven down. If you like, put your head on the ground and put your two legs up. Papa, nothing can happen. Papa, you cannot do anything. You cannot stop me. Except, Papa, chai. Papa, see, do your worst. Do your worst. I should do my worst. Mm -hmm. Later, you said I should do my worst. You heard me. Oh. Can you imagine this girl? Look at when she talked to you and walked out on you, Papa. This girl doesn't have any respect for you. I don't blame her. No, I don't blame her. It's Elon Musk and Muju that I blame. Papa, allow me to deal with this people now. Papa, allow me to deal with No, now. Papa, I don't think I can allow this to be done. My son, don't worry. I will handle it. It's really dealing. Don't worry. Papa, allow me. Just allow me. Don't worry. I will handle it. I will handle it. Don't worry. 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 No. No. I must put an end to this. As I was over and back on a ledge, I must put an end to this whole rubbish. Okay, I did not know what I know. It was more than a boy. I'm not sure, but 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 I'm not sure. Is this one now? Yeah? Can someone have peace in his own house again? Would you? I know you people are inside that house and you can hear me. Come outside. I am here. Polycap is here. I don't know Uh uh. Oh, you want to come outside of here? What have you come here to do this every morning? I told you to leave this matter, that I will handle it. What have you come here to do? What is happening here? Papa! So this is what you meant by you will handle it? Will you stop? Shut up! Ochoba, what is happening here? You are asking me? You are asking me? So you and your daughter have succeeded your plans. You want to kill myself for me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uncle, what plans are you talking about? Uh -huh. Look at your plans. You want to kill myself for me? Hey. Look, at it. Look at my son lying down here and you asking me what, what plan. You want to kill him? You and your mother. Right? Papa! Papa! What is it? Let me ask you a question. What were you doing in this compound in the middle of the night? Hey. Papa, answer me. Papa, answer me. I mean, what were you doing here? Last night after we had that problem, what did you come to this compound to do, Papa? Oh, Papa, you suddenly cannot speak anymore, right? They have cut off your tongue up here. Hey! Papa! That sweet soup that you prepared for Auntie Yoma Hey! 
your son has eaten it. Hey! hey! Congratulations! Would you? Hey! Are you my enemies accusing me of being responsible for what happened to my son? No, 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 no. How can I? Hey! Accusing you of anything? Hey! I am not. Hey! Wow! And where are you? Where are you? Children, you, are, you, you have achieved your plan. Children, you have achieved your plan. Papa, you see your son Polika. Your son is real. Real for life. Because it's his stroke. Hey, Papa, stroke is incurable. It's an incurable disease. Congratulations, I don't Papa. Hey! Come on, help me. Let's carry him to the house. Hey! Come on, help me. Let's carry him to the house. Me. How are you what? You have more important things to do. Hey! Enjoy! Congratulations! Sister, come and help me now. What is that? What are you doing? 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 I love you! What are you doing? 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 Kogu se madi be en dia fi bolo ke du lo baroge opa ma ke go thousands thousands wonder na wonder 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 ada ada princess princess Were you the one who went to the chemist to get me drugs last night? Yes, Princess. Good. Go to that same shop and call the chemist boy for me. Why, my Princess? Has the sick sickness started again? No, I am fine. Just go and call him for me. We like to him to come with any drugs. Have you gone mad? I said I am fine. Get out of here! Go and call him for me! Your blood pressure is slightly high. What could be the cause? I don't know, maybe stress. I think you have to see a doctor. Okay, sir, no problem. I'll do just that. I'll just try one more time and see. Good day, sir. Good day. How are you? I'm fine. How's the princess? Is she okay? Did she ask you to get some job? No, she asked that I call you. Call me. But you said she's fine. Why did she ask you to call me? Sir, she's fine. She asked me to come with you to the palace. Okay. Um, I'm sorry, I can't do that now because I'm attending to my patient. I'll do that when I'm done. Ah. Sir, she said I shouldn't come back to the palace without you. Please, let's go. Okay, you'll have to wait for me to finish with my patient. Okay, sir. And when I'm done, I'll follow you. Huh? Okay, sir. Thank you. Why are they not here? Good day, my princess. Good day. Oh, please. Have a seat. Oh, thank you. You can go. Um, <sighs> you, you sent for me. Do you feel better now? Yes, I am perfect now. The drugs you gave to me really worked. That's nice. Thank you so much. Thank you for 
saving my life. I mean, I, after taking those drugs, I was fine, and it still surprises me. That, that's fine. You're, you're welcome. That's what I do. I take care of sick people. Hmm. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. So, what's your name and where are you from? My name is Obina. I'm from Umago community. Oh, Umago community, yes. the neighboring village. Yes, the community after this one. Oh, 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 yes, I remember. I remember. Mm -hmm. um, sorry. You're uh, welcome. How are your parents, the Igwe and the, the Queen? Yes, they are fine. My mother is fine, my father is fine. And how are your parents? Um, my father is doing fine, but well, my mother is dead. Oh. She's late, yes. So sorry. Thank you. You know, I invited you here because I wanted to see this man who saved my life and to say thank you. But now that you are here, I am so excited. I am happy. You're welcome. Meanwhile, you are handsome. Hmm? You heard me. Oh, me? Oh, <laughs> my princess. Are you sure you see clearly? <laughs> <laughs> of course, I can see clearly. Yeah. Thank you very much for the compliment. I'm sorry, I didn't offer you anything. Please, I want you to have a drink. No, 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 I'm fine. <laughs> Are you sure? I'm fine. As a matter of fact, I'll be on my way now. I have lots of patients waiting for me mm. at the shop. Yes. I would love to visit your shop one of these days. Really? Yes. Oh. Uh, it, it will be a great honor to have you, the princess, in my shop, my small shop. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing is too small. Anyways, let me see you. I don't know. The, the... I insist. My orders are final. If I'm good, good, no game. I'm a digital king. Una go. Father, you said you were not so good. You must have been so sad. Oh, he is the famous boy who did a lot of things Father, I just invited into the palace to say thank you for saving my life. Just that. What is wrong in me inviting a man who saved my life to the palace? At least just to show appreciation. Nobody is going to see around you. Princess, you are the king. What will people say when they see you? I just want to see everyone anywhere around you again. I don't even know what to say. I am so surprised at you, Father. But I want you to remember that this same person you refer to as a man was the same person who saved your daughter's life. Even 
the middle of the night, at the point of death, Father. I'm a digital king. I'm a digital king. I'm a connection. Chief for many Chief for many Life is a journey. Everyone with his or her destiny. And I But some people. Uh -huh. ah. Mama. What is it? Uh, I don't know. Hey. I don't know. Oh, my body is hot. Mama, your body is very hot. Oh. Hey. hey, I'm sure this is malaria. This headache and I'm high fever. Hey, God, what do I do? I don't know if there's money in this house. Oh. No matter that, let me check if there's money inside there. Oh, wait, wait. I'm coming. I'm coming, Mama. Hey, Mama. Mama, I've seen money. Let me wash a mixed dress for you. I'm coming. Oh. Please just wait, I'm coming. Life is a journey. Everyone with his or her destiny. And I got no. But some people, extreme wicked. Oh. They got the money, jump my money. And we're put to my boy, Rama. She was born. Young lady, watch the road now. Where are you going? I'm going to the chemist. My mother is sick. She's dying. Come, come. You said what? I'm going to the chemist. My mother is sick. She's dying. Wait, you, you want to buy drugs? Yes, I want to buy drugs. I'm going to the chemist. I, I own a chemist. Yes. Where, where is your mother? She's at home. What's wrong with her? I don't know. I don't know. She's having fever. I, I think her eyes dropped on before I left. Come, come. Let's go. Let's go. I have a chemist. Come. <laughs> Thank you. You say you don't know what's wrong with her? I don't know. I don't know. How long has this happened? They got the money, chum, mum, mum. And we're put to my boy, Rama. She was born. And we're put to my boy, I'm bien you. I'm a good show. I'm a good show. So normally, we're supposed to run a blood test to know what is wrong with your mother. But if you follow the prescription written here, I'm sure your mother will be fine before tomorrow evening. Okay. But these drugs are many, yo. Okay, how much? It's just 4,600. Hey. I knew, I knew that's what you would say. Something like that. That's why I said the drugs are many. I have only 500 naira. I don't know if you can bring it to a one. Uh, I mix it no, so I can it's, give it to her. It's malaria and typhoid drugs. You have to complete the dose. Please just mix it. No, the dosage there. has to be completed. I don't Listen, know. just go. Go and treat your mother first. Okay? I should go. With the drugs. Without the money. Listen. Your mother's life is important. Okay? Give your mother the drugs first. You can pay me later. Thank you. Thank no, 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 you. God up. bless you. Get up. God bless you, sir. Get up. <sighs> okay. See, you have to come back here tomorrow and take me to your mother. Oh, okay. I would like to run a blood test. Okay? Mama? Mama? Hmm? I am back. Okay. I came back with enough drugs, eh? <laughs> You'll be fine. Let me get water for you. Oh, 
I'm coming, no. She was born, a weapon to her. I buy your piano, Mama. Hello. How are you feeling today? I'm sure you're better. Ah, I'm getting better. You're getting better. Uh, at mm. least today is far better than yesterday. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Can I direct you on now? You're welcome. You're welcome. Um, my son. Mama. I am very, very happy. Hmm? How can I pay you back? My daughter here told me. <laughs> I can add the on now. Uh, Mama, this Welcome. is not the time to talk about that. Huh? I actually came to give you an injection. So let's go inside so I can quickly do that. You didn't tell her. <laughs> hey. Yes, cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. um, would you please carry me? Carry me. Carry me. Yes. We'll help you inside. Get up. Uh -huh. Hey. Uh -huh. At least you can see my life uh, is very small. small. <laughs> when I see you this one, you feel it. Uh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so so much. I really appreciate it. Eh? What would I have done without you with the whole situation? We thank God for everything. Mm, it's okay. God bless you. Amen. Um, take care of Mama. Mm? Oh yes, I will. Um, she needs a lot of rest. Yes, I will. So ensure she gets that. Oh sure, I will. I have to rush to the shop now. A lot of people are waiting for me. Okay. Yeah. Let me walk you. No, 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 no worry. Just stay, with Mama. Are eh? you sure? Don't worry. Stay, with Mama. Thank take you. Take care. Bye, bye. You're going somewhere? No, no, no. I came to see you. You came to see me. I hope there's no problem. There's no problem. Eh, uh, my mother said I should bring this plantain to you. It's a way of appreciating you for what you did for us. Not even minding you don't know who we are. So she said I should bring it to you. <laughs> Would you? <laughs> Would you listen? I, I did what I did because I wanted to save your mother's life. I don't expect any reward from anybody. Eh? <laughs> but we are humans. And if we don't appreciate you, we will not be comfortable. So that's why we passed this. Please accept it. Please don't say no. Hmm. Okay, I'll accept it, but don't do this again. Okay. <laughs> huh? Thank you for accepting it. You're welcome. I'll be on my way. Please, my regards to your mother. Eh? Okay. Okay. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. Princess, I I wasn't expecting to see you. And who is she? I mean, the girl who just left here. Oh, <laughs> Uju. <laughs> I don't know her name. Uh, yes, uh, Uju is one of my customers. I just treated her mother, so she came to show appreciation with this <laughs> with this bunch of plantain. Oh, really? I hope so, because I wouldn't want to drag anything with all these low-class village girls. You know you are a cute guy. You shouldn't be mingling with such people. Drag? I don't understand. Anyways, never mind. I said I should come and see you and also know your shop. Oh. I'm, I'm actually very surprised to see you. Um, thank you for coming to my shop. Please come in. Come inside. She 
She was fun, I went to the world. I buy a bien de Dieu. Princess. For some hours you disappeared from this palace without telling anyone where you went. Not even me nor your father. Where did you go? Mom, I, I went to see Obina. Obina. And uh, who is this Obina? The chemist boy who saved my life. Oh my word. You're sick and you didn't tell me? No, Mom. I am not sick. I just went to see him. Do you have to do that? Mom, he is my friend and I don't see anything wrong in visiting a friend. And what sort of stupid friendship is that? Haven't you thanked him enough? Or do you still want to thank him in a special way? Have I not warned you never to be seen around that boy? That loafer. The last time he was here, I asked you, you told me there is nothing between you. And now look at this. Now listen, young lady. Next time I heard you were seen around that boy, you see the other side of me. Now get out of my sight. Woman, who are you? Wanda. She's also your daughter. She cannot tell me. <laughs> My king, take it easy. Your blood runs in her. Easy. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're welcome. <sighs> Come on, be careful, eh? Oh, my dear. Uh, Mama is not strong, John. Very strong. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Uh, sorry. Uh -huh. <sighs> Mama? Yes. I'm I very, am. very happy eh? that you're back to life. Yes. But there's something I want you to do for me. Yeah. Both of you. And what is that, my son? Once in a while, <sighs> I want you to treat malaria. Yes, you know we live in Africa yes. and we have mosquitoes everywhere. So it's very important that you treat malaria to stay healthy. Uh -huh. mm. Wait, are you saying we should be taking drugs? Malaria drugs? Or... No, no. So the right thing to do is to run a test, a malaria test, mm. before you take drugs. Okay, so we should always run tests before yes, taking the drugs. That's the right thing to do. I gave you drugs because your situation was very urgent. But the right thing I was supposed to do was to run a test first. Hmm. Yes. So they always choose my doctor. <laughs> I don't like that need. My doctor. Mama. I have to go back to you. Thank you so Thank much. You. Eh? My God. God Almighty. We surely pay you for all you did for us god will pay you back for all you did thank you for amen. us amen. Eh? Amen. Mama, i have to rush now oh amen. My God. go to the shop there's nobody there okay all right take care bye 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 bye, bye, -bye. thank you hey welcome <laughs> uh, 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 yes uncle come here is he calling me i don't know but go and answer him who but be very, very careful. He's evil man. I'm coming, oh. On a piano. Ha. I'm here. Who was that boy I saw you and your mother discussing with? Because I've been seeing him in this house. What is he looking for? What is he coming here to do? And then we normally buy drugs from him. As a matter of fact, he was one that told my mother when she was sick. Is your mother not okay? She's okay. She's okay. So what is that boy coming here to do? Yeah? I'm asking, what is he coming here to do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
me not be what I'm thinking. Let me not be what I'm thinking with you. If you want to run after men, you go out there and do it. Not in this compound. If you can't get nonsense in this compound again, I don't want to see that boy in this compound again. Do you hear me? I don't want to see that stupid boy in this compound again. <laughs> hey! Eh, eh, he's taking me. Papa, what did I just hear you say? Are my ears deceiving me or what? Papa, you don't want to see who in most compound. Hey, Papa, you are a troublemaker. Mind your business. Mind your business, oh! Or I don't know Ujumwa's guardian angel. Who now decides who comes to see Ujumwa and who doesn't? Papa, mind your business. This is too much trouble. Papa, are you not ashamed? Papa, you should be ashamed of yourself. Ujumwa's mother was sick. You could not even give her a hundred naira to buy common paracetamol. That same young man, you're warning Ujumwa to stop saying, is the same man who treated her mother. Papa, face your problems. Look at your son, suffering from stroke, the same stroke you brought upon him. You have not finished facing that one. You want to jump and leave your family problems and go to other people's family to solve their problems. Papa, mind your business. Here! Um, dear Ujuma, you know what? Just go to your house. Eh? Go and face your business and face your mother. Don't mind this wicked man. Ignore him! I will see you later. Because see you later, man. I will not Papa, be let her go. She asked you to go and you are not to go. Just going. go. Just go. What nonsense. Yeah, Rita. Rita. Uh -huh. So, you have grown wings to talk to me, your father, like that. Eh? Yeah? So, uh, Ujumwa and her mother have brought you over. Okay? They have brought you over so you can talk to me anyhow you like. No, it's not you I'm talking to, Papa. I'm talking to it's spirits. All right. It's alright. It's alright. We shall see. Spirits. Papa, if you do not want me to talk to you anyhow, if you want me to respect you, you have to stop evil. Papa, stop evil. This evil is too much. What do you even get from being wicked? What do you gain? And let me tell you, time shall come when you will tell me if you are the one of this house. <laughs> you will tell me if you are the one that built this I'm house for me. Please, Don't worry. Please, I'm pleased. You. Enough of the threats. Let it's the okay. time come now. If I let the time come today, enough. Let the time come. When the time come, when will the time ever come? Papa, let me tell you whatever you want to say, I am ready for you. I will give it to you the way you bring it. I am not afraid of you. Ah. The message is change. Ah. Change. Okay. You are not afraid of me. You are not afraid, afraid of me. You. Change, change, Papa. Don't worry. See, if you don't take time, I can't go in. I will kill for you. I will kill for you. Change. I will kill for you. I will kill for you. Change. I will do with you. Change. I will get out of my sight. Leave this place. Change. Evil man. I will kill I will kill for you. I will forget that you are my daughter. I will kill for you. Don't worry. Change. You are my son. Change. You are my son. Change. 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 Yes, sir. Okay. Sir, make sure you take plenty of water. Okay, thank you very much. Right. I'm sorry. One of my patients. It's okay. So, tell me the story. You remember the story you were going to tell me about? The one that made you stay out of school? I don't know. I don't know where to start. Just start from anywhere. Well, according to my mother and every member of the community. My late father was supposed to be the ego of this kingdom. But 
he died. He will say that he went to, to bed one night and he didn't wake up the next morning. Then, five days after his death, my supposed brother went missing. And the people who went to look for him came up with his clothes and a name which confirmed that the people who kidnapped him had killed him. After that, my uncle, my uncle saw the truth. really understand you. 
You mean Obina said all this? Yeah. I am telling you, I am still finding out to believe this is true. Who hmm. is this boy? Who sent him to this family? Why is he doing all this? First, he saved my life. Now, he has promised to sponsor your education. Um, come on. Did he tell you anything? Like... He wants you to be his girlfriend. Or he wants to marry you. Any of this. Hmm. Mama? Hmm? At all? Nothing. He did not say anything like that. Nothing. Hey! Although I wouldn't know if maybe he had such a mind yeah. and would want to say it later. But as for now, if you say anything, just like that. Just like that. Okay. All right. Let's watch and see. Mm. <sighs> what about the list he asked you to write? Mama, I have a... I have written everything in it. Okay. And I will go and give it to him later. Okay. She better do. Hmm? It is well. I know that God, God Almighty, in His infinite mercy, is seeing us. He knows what we are passing through. Yes. Hmm. God knows the best. Yes. And he's doing it for us. So don't worry. <sighs> don't worry. <sighs> it's okay. Life is a journey. Everyone with his or her destiny. And I don't know. Since you are not comfortable. Huh? Oh, yes, yes. Uh, no, I am not comfortable. I, I mean, you're royalty. Your father is the king of this kingdom. And if someone sees us together, they will go straight to him. And I don't want any trouble. Relax. I brought you here. Exactly my point. Why, why did you bring me here? What are we doing here? Okay. I will tell you. Since that day you saved my life, and I invited you to the palace. After our conversation that day, I saw something special. You possess certain qualities that I am attracted to. That's why I want us to get to know each other better. To see what happens. Huh? To see what happens. What's going to happen? Things like what? Don't tell me you are so naive that you don't know when someone loves you. Thank you for loving me. Huh? Um, but if I understood you correctly, what you're trying to say is you want us to get to know each other better. And you want to know if something can happen between us, right? Yes. Well, I'm sorry, that's not possible. Then you are not a man. No, I am a man. Listen, your royalty. Your father is the king of this kingdom. And he is my father. I know you, Your father is the king of this kingdom. Your father is 
the king. I am not in your class. I cannot be around you because I am not royalty. I have to be in your class to be around you, but I am not. Besides, I don't want troubles. I don't want any trouble, please. I am my father's daughter. And whatever makes me happy, that's exactly what I'm going to do. My father cannot stop me. Nobody can stop me. Anyways, let's change this conversation. Let's have our drink. Eh? I'm telling you. Uju. Hmm? Chai. This Obina guy is a very nice person. Oh. Very, very nice person. Do you know what it means to sponsor someone who's not related to you through school? Hmm. In these hard times. My sister. Chai. Honestly, eh? I am as surprised as you are. It's so cool. You know, I did not believe it until he gave me all the money needed to sort everything out of my school. Hey! That was when I woke up to reality. You see, you're on a meme. That's on a meme. God bless him. Hey! May God bless him. Amen. Amen. Would you? Let me just tell you something. It's a quick advice. You know, for somebody like this, who has done this, you don't need to hurt him in any way. Uh -uh. Avoid anything that will make you hurt him. Before uncle. I don't know now. Look, even if he happens to ask you to be his, you know what I'm talking mm -mm. about. I don't know what you're talking about. I beg you know. Every you time your mind will just be running up and down. As Where has speed? your mind run to now? <laughs> On a speed. Look, as a sharp thinker, you know I have to think ahead. Ahead of us. <laughs> Don't hurt him more. Hey. He has not even said anything. You're serious. I'm telling you, my sister. See this guy? I see him as, you know, just a nice person. Hey, God sent. His mind is not like all these other people when they want to do anything for you. They will start saying, no, 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 no. He's a good person. Hmm. I know he's a good person. But are you not saying that if he happens to ask you to be his, that thing we are talking about? That now makes him a bad person. I did not say that. Yeah, so what are you saying? I have not said that. Say. So you better just get. Why you twisting? Twisting everything. Please don't make me want to do something. I told you. Why did I go to your house? Mama, Mama, I'm off to school, oh. Uncle, good morning. Uh, Why did she start school again? Who gave her a month to prepare for school? Who gave her a month to prepare for school? Who gave her a month to prepare for school? And she's still working in school for me. So, how was school today? Huh. School was good. Honestly, I was the happiest person in school today. <laughs> Thank you. Congrats. Thank you so much. Um, I don't mean to disturb you. I know that you have tried. What happened? What's wrong? The, the book I told you about. Oh, the test book. How much is it? 1,800. Here, there's enough money. You can keep the change after buying the book. Hey, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. Yes. Let me go and show it to my mother. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Okay. okay. I got you. Bye bye. Ah, princess. Good evening. 
I'll be on my way now. No okay, bye bye. Um, I will cook and bring for you this evening. No problem. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Uh, my guest, your mother, eh? <laughs> Princess, how are you? What does she always come to do in the shop? Who is she to be? Uju. Uju is my friend. We're just friends. Just friends? Yes. You just gave her money. You even hugged her right before me. She also said she was going to cook for you. So tell me. What sort of friendship is that? Um, Princess, please. Eh? These questions don't come out right. Please. Oh. Anyways. That's not why I'm here. I'm starting. They got a money jump one moon. A web or two. A boy or a boy or a boy or a boy or a my daughter, are you still here thinking about what the princess told you? I've told you to forget about her. She's only being stupid and jealous. My, 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 my problem is, I don't understand it. What's her problem? Did I tell her I'm dragging Obina with her? Did I tell her I am dragging him with her? No, my dear. I've told you that Igwe and his family are not good people. Though Lolo and the princess are a little bit better than him. No, she's not better. She is like father, like daughter. Very stupid girl. My daughter, remember the story I told you about your late father, who was supposed to be the king of this kingdom. You are the one who is supposed to be in that position. Come on, she doesn't know. But your father died. Kedi hai geme? I gebog babende mo. No. And we are not going to blame God. He knows the best. So please, forget them. Especially the princess. Yes, I don't want their trouble. Chelo, Mama, I'm even trying to understand you too. You don't want their trouble. That's you're saying I should stop seeing Obina. Because of who? The princess? Mama, that is very impossible. I would rather have it hot with her. Mamma, I will not do it. No, it hasn't come to that. I did not say you should not see Obina. So what are you saying, Mama? Can you what I'm saying is that you have to be very, very careful. She should be careful of me. Oh. Please, she should be careful of me. listen to me, your mother. Um, how is Obina? How is he doing? Why well, he was fine when I left him yesterday. Like you're here, I don't like you. Don't like you. Don't like you. Don't like you. No, I'm going to let her go. She's only a story that is so disturbing to the ear. What story, Father? That he saw you quarreling with his brother's daughter over him. That chemist boy to be precise. Is that correct? <laughs> oh, that. <sighs> Father, I wasn't quarreling. I I just want her to stay away from Obina. Obina is my friend and I 
I don't want to share him with anybody. So it's true. You fought with a fellow woman over that love. That boy that has no son. Now, if I may ask you, what kind of relationship exists between both of you? Father, let me just tell you the truth. I'm in love with Obina. You are stupid. You are insane. I think you cannot. How can you open your mouth and say such nonsense? You are in love with that boy, that common chemist boy. Are you saying? Of all the people in this kingdom, that idiot. No, let me let me warn you. I don't want to hear that boy's name in this palace anymore. But father, listen to me. I don't want you to be seen anywhere around his chemist shop. If you dare me, I'll turn you and send you back to England. And you never set your feet on this land until after ten years. Let me see if your senses will come back. Father, tell me, get out of this place now. My orders are fine If I will go no game, I'm a digital king. Una no go. Mr. Obinna, your majesty needs your presence at the palace right now. My presence? Is anyone sick? You ask so many questions. I have a reason for asking. I want to know if I can come with some job. Nobody's sick in the palace. You're wasting my time. Okay, give me some time to lock the shop. My orders are fine. If I'm good, good, no game. I'm a digital king. Young man, I call you here to ask you some questions. Who are you? Who is your father? Which kingdom do you come from? Your Majesty. My name is Obina Nsofo, the son of Iche Onyema Nsofo. Yeah. I run a small chemist shop. I am from Umuago community. My father is a farmer. <laughs> My mother died so many years ago. Uh, uh, can't you see from what you told me? You are a son of nobody. Of course, who knows your father? Your father is nobody. Even the kingdom you come from. He said no kingdom. Anyway, I, I got a report that my daughter fought with someone uh, on the street, all because of you. Is that correct? Because of me. For to someone. Your Majesty, I, I have no idea. I, I don't know. Why would she do a thing like that? When I confronted her, she boldly told me that she is in love with you. Just you. Is that correct? No, no, no. Your Majesty, that is a lie. I, I, I don't have anything to do with her. We're just friends. Just friends? We're just friends. And let me ask you again. Who are you to be friends with my daughter? Do you know this kingdom? Do you know this palace? Who are you? Can't you see that? From what you told me, who you are. The gap between you and my daughter is just from here to Soko to Oh yes You are nobody 
That's true. That's true, Your Majesty. Good. Now let me warn you. Henceforth, stay away from my family. That is, if you still want to run that your miserable shop, you call chemist or whatever. Stay away from my daughter. If for any reason she comes to your shop, chase her away. Or better say, run away. Tell her that you are not interested. Can you hear me? Yes, Your Majesty. But Your Majesty, what if she comes to buy drugs? Now, will you shut up your mouth? Buy what? You? When we have a family doctor that has a hospital that is well stocked, well equipped, what what is he coming for you for your drugs? No, 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 no. You will never need your drugs for anything. If for any reason anybody from my palace needs drugs, we, we have servants, we have guards that can take care of that. We have no business with you. We have nothing to do with your shop. Are you getting me? Yes, your I master. repeat, we don't need your services. If you still want to run that your miserable chemist shop in this community, stay away from my family. Yes, your majesty. Now get out. Your majesty. I said get out. <laughs> Uju, are you serious? I'm telling you. The princess saw you and said that to you? <laughs> if you see the harassment today, if you see the harassment, I started asking myself, have you paid her bride price? Uju, what does that mean? What do you mean to say? For a woman to stop her fellow woman on the road, warning her to stay away from one man, <laughs> what should I say now? Uju, stop. I need you to stop it right now. I'm sorry. I can understand why the ego is sent for me. He actually asked me to stop coming around his daughter. He said his daughter boldly told him that she was in love with me, that we're both in love. You see? You see what I'm talking about? Whoa! Look at it now! Look at it! Not to worry, I know what to do. <laughs> it's okay, I know what to do. It's, it's, it's not just funny. What do you want from you? Cha cha! It's a good evening, no? Ah, my children, how are you? I'm uh, fine, Iche. <laughs> good evening. Good evening. Sir. I hope you know. Sir. How is your father, my good friend? He's fine. Uh, it's, it's been a long time. Yes. You are very correct. But don't worry. Hmm? Very soon, I will come and visit you people. Mm. Thank you. Mm. Thank you. Mm. My daughter. Iche. Come. Princess, how could you tell your father we are in love? I never accepted your proposal. I told you it wasn't possible because we are not of the same class or status. According to your father, you're better than me because I am not royalty. Listen, I love my little chemist shop where I make money 
in fact where i make little money to take care of myself and my family and i refuse to allow any woman distract me and for your information your father had threatened i stay away from you else i'll be faced with the consequences of being banished from this kingdom and i'm not going to let that happen they will do you harassed only need my help i'm only helping her there's nothing more you have no right to do that to her and i don't want that to ever happen again please You mean my father invited you to the palace and said all that to you? Yes. Did you also say Uju is just your friend? Nothing more? For now, there's nothing. I haven't made up my mind yet. For now, nothing more. You haven't made up your mind yet. And what does that supposed to uh, mean? Listen, ca can we stop this drama? Would you respect, princess? Can we stop the now drama? Now you listen, Obina. I love you. And no girl born of any woman can take you away from me. Huh? Not even Uju. As for my father, don't worry. I will take care of him. Huh? Obina. Huh? Honorable Commissioner, how are you? Uh, how is your family? <laughs> Good. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm fine, only that. You know, we in the ways we are suffering. <laughs> we are doing a thankless job. From one case to another, you've been there sitting on this. Settling cases, it's, it's not easy. Oh, yes. Mm. Thank you. Uh, uh, what of the papers? Are they signed? Wow. That's great. It's signed. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. Your 20% is guaranteed. For an 80 million naira, you have your court. <laughs> I'm a man of my words, you know that. Trust me. No, 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 no. I'm not like you politicians. We traditional rulers, we keep to our words. <laughs> oh, yes. It's okay, it's okay. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Father! Father! Daughter, what is the problem? Father, you are my problem. How? Father, how can you invite my love Obina to the palace just to insult him? Father, you even told him he's a low class and a nobody. Father, are you his creator? Do you know what he will become tomorrow? Father, this is so wrong. This is not fair. Ah, uh, I see. So you are fully set for marriage? Yes. Considering your age? Yes, father. Because I love him. And age does not matter in marriage. I'll provide you a husband. Yes, I've been keeping this young man for you for a long time. Depending when you are ready. He is from a royal home. Very decent boy. Not that silly chemist boy. They will be coming here next week. Yes, so get ready. We will marry you before this chemist boy messes up your brain. What? What is going on here? Christmas, what is it? Mother. Can you imagine father telling me that he has a husband for me? And that he is coming, the so-called husband is coming next week. As a child? 
I can't make my own decisions. Well, um, maybe your father God bless you for speaking the truth. Yes, for standing on the side of truth. You see, I want the best for her. So I have this young man from a royal room that will come and then Obi, Ejebu Obi, not that silly, rough looking, homeless chemist boy. No, 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 it's, it's not befitting. I, I, I won't take that. Let me tell both of you. Obina is my future husband, and there's nothing anybody can do about it. Till then. On your daughter, um, she is getting me angry. It's alright, I will do that. Can I make a suggestion? Go ahead. To me, why not invite this young man over and uh, speak with him politely to find out if he truly loves our daughter? To my understanding, he might be denying it because of the way you do harass him. And if he does, we can set him up to suit our royal standard to be able to marry our daughter. It's our daughter's happiness we are talking about. The princess of our Loma kingdom. What do you say? Will it not be better you shut your mouth if you have nothing meaningful to say? Mm. Look at what I put myself into. Yes. My son. My only son. The only thing I have in this world. Not that my useless not that bad, I don't have respect for me. All the money I've been spending to make sure that my son is well, it's just a waste. Come on, I'll get this. It's ready. If this thing continues like this, <laughs> if this thing continues like this, For me, I am not even a member of this family. Very soon, I'm going to get married and leave this miserable house. This is the condition you would have put Auntie Hyoma into. But God has punished you. It has bounced back on your son and you both are suffering. All the money you're spending on Polika, without improvement, is the same money you would have used for something reasonable but because of your evil this is where you are no problem i don't even blame you oh papa i don't blame you in all of this i blame polika because he was constantly supporting your evil deeds enjoy enjoy this soup that you have cooked <laughs>
kingdom is a little bit far though it's not a good reason i should not visit my good friend <laughs> thank god you know and you have corrected yourself it's okay i'm okay i'm okay with that <laughs> ah. my friend will suffer there's a big problem that is why i'm here the problem that would have made ibik with my friend Move from Umwa Laoma to Umwagu in search of me. <laughs> that problem must be a very big problem. Your son, Obina, is about to make a terrible mistake that everybody will regret. What did he do? There is this girl, Uju, from Umwa Laoma, from Lit. Igwe Obiozo's family. I saw both of them standing under the tree by the bush side talking. My friend, the way I saw them, I know that both of them are falling in love. We need to stop them. This girl, Uju, the daughter of late uh, Okeze, from the lineage of late Igwe Obiozo. Yes. If I may ask, what is wrong if my son marries from their family? Yeah, are you the one talking? A lot. Let us not argue about that one now. We'll talk about that one later. Just talk to your son to stop whatever he is doing with that girl. It's okay, I've heard you. I will send for my son. He will be in a position to tell me what is exactly going on. Hmm? What of if he said he wants to marry the girl? Let us wait for that time. Let us wait. <laughs> Continue your drink, my friend. How are you? Ibe Kobina. Please. I want you to see reason to me. I know it's not in my place to ask you to marry me because I'm a woman and also a princess. But I also want you to know that I have seen men. I have seen well women. But it's you I want. You are my kind of man. You possess the qualities I want. I know you have a problem with my father. But I can assure you that I will take care of it. Can I ask you a question? Yes. If I decide to marry you, if I decide to make you my wife, how do I face your father? Listen. You know my father is just a farmer. A common farmer and I'm from a very poor background I run a chemist shop if your father locks me up tomorrow if he gets me arrested and locks me up tomorrow who's gonna bail me who's gonna bring me out I don't want trouble please Obina can you just be a man stop talking like a woman and go for what belongs to you huh who the princess belongs to who? Ha! <sighs> I'll, I'll think about it. Oh. 
Evina. I love you so much. So much. I, I, I have a patient waiting for me in the shop. I have to go now. But why? Thank you. My son, tell me the truth. What relationship do you have with Tuchu? Papa, Uju is my friend. And we are very close. But I don't have any sexual relationship with her. She's a very good girl. But she has a personal problem. She's from a very poor background. And sometimes they hardly feed. Papa, there was a time her mother fell sick. And they couldn't raise money to treat her. I was forced to treat her mother free of charge. Papa, as we speak, I am the one paying for her education. I am just trying to help her and her family the little way I can. Are you sure of what you are telling me? Papa, I have never lied to you before and I can't start now. But Papa, how did you know about Uju? Um, I don't really know her. But I have a very close friend in that community. Papa, is your friend Iche Ibekwe? Yes. I thought as much. He saw us a few days ago discussing. Papa, some men also gossip. Well, according to what you told me, helping Uju out in our education is a good thing. Because God can use anybody from anywhere to help anyone. But I must warn you, was never, never ever have any essential About why? Because the day you do it, both of you will die instantly. Papa, why are you scaring me? Why, why all these warnings? But why can't I marry her? Is she not a woman? Or is it because she's from a poor background? The Umagu community and the Obiozos, her family, have a bond. Never to marry each other. Papa, what happens if I marry her? I've told you. What? I will explain to you later. Okay, Papa, how about the Igwe's daughter? Since you said Uju is a no-go area, what happens if I marry the Igwe's daughter? As for marrying the Igwe's daughter, I will think about it. I will give you my answer tomorrow. Life is a journey, everyone with his or her destiny, and I can know. But some people, extreme wicked, oh. You're here. 
Yeah. I am off to the shop. Okay. okay. Uh, but wait, wait. Uh, on that issue of your marrying uh, the princess of whom I uh, I've slept to her it and come to a conclusion. But first, have you discussed anything with her? Um, not really, Papa. But she has been asking me to accept her proposal, but I haven't said anything yet. Accept What is don't do anything with her yet? Hmm? For now. Ah, but Papa, why are you confusing me? What do you mean, accept her, but don't do anything yet? Look at this boy. What is confusing you in 